Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Fate. In the last episode, we got pretty far on the 33rd floor. This episode, we're gonna be clearing it, and we're also gonna be fishing. There you are, enemies. That's a lot of you. That's... A lot of you. Good thing for super potions. Just checking to see if this is even a... Yep, I figured that was a special item. Alright. Not that I'm gonna use it, considering it's a shield, but at least we have a special item here. Need to level my strength so much. There's another swamp sorceress. A lot of ghosts. You cannot carry any more. You cannot carry any more. Let's just organize this a little better and. Yes, I will. Ha. In the end, the grandeur of items has eluded me. Earth are the items of the people. You are fortified. Probably in this patch, if I had to guess. I didn't go here. And there it is. 
The quest is completed. It's completed. All right, now let's go. Let's go over to the fishing spot and mark a portal there. You enter the portal. All right. Your pack is full. Oops. You are overburdened. Still overburdened. Um. Uh. Okay, because I would like to sell the war cleaver of the worm. I think these two are just XP and gold. Yeah. You have gained an experience and skill. Dual wheeling for the strike. Yeah. Sell that and then we'll come back and oh wait, we already defeat the quest. 77k is not the best, but at least it's something. Yeah, I can equip this on the other ring. It does about the same damage, but it's fast. Unfortunately, it's only 3,000, or 8,000, because I can tell you it's not going to be good. Nope. Welcome, friend. I believe I need thirty four too. And you're always welcome here. Here. <laughs> I'm gonna take everything from my pet that is not my fishing equipment. Sell this stuff. Why is this here? Um... Put down the super healing charms. I don't really want to lose these, so I'm just going to put these in here too. the portal. Now we just have that to fish. Drop my map. Twenty four, twenty two. Twenty two or twenty. Twenty. 
10, 15. You can't zoom in super far like I have right now, but it's kind of distracting. Also, despite Mm, some people don't know is that this game is actually moddable. You can mod this game. The models and the textures, I believe, are in a folder that you can edit. I have done that before. I have changed faces of characters. voice in it. Girling Trout. So far, so nothing. Oops. I may look up if fishing is actually determinate by this. I'm pretty sure it is, but it never feels like it until you actually start getting stuff that this works. And the crap. I got distracted by talking and I missed a fish. Anyway. It never feels like it's working until you actually get an orange item. And I've had it work so well that I've gotten five before in like back-to-back -back situations. In the past. Why are the fish not grabbing? Still nothing. I'm really hoping the tourmaline is a good sign.
jagged tooth. That is impossible. There we go. Grab another one. Reaving Carver. We'll go over what those things do later. Mainly what I'm fishing for is not money anymore, it's items that I can actually equip. Alright, well, I'm gonna be eating all of this crap fish. Your pet has been transformed. 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 Oops. Also, should probably eat these. They're not good either, and I don't want to keep bad fish. Because this game doesn't seem to have the fish that I want. So... Alright, a dogfish. Just what I needed. So, Lifestone Parade, 100, plus 120 attack bonus, wow. However, it is polearm class. If I was a polearm person, I would definitely be going for that. Because that seems like a broken sword, or reaver. The only thing about it, though, is the piercing resistance penalty. So you're going to get pierced really badly. Not a good thing. Especially with a lot of the enemies to do pierce damage. That being said, though, if you can manage killing the enemies without... Um, that, then... Great. Tusker. It's a lot of defense. It's built for more of a tank character. It's kind of weak, though. And again, I'm really tempted to stay here until I get another equipment piece for myself. 
Because I only have one currently. And I'd like to have a set before the end of the game. I don't have to have this, mind you. It just would be nice. Although, so this can probably be labeled the fishing episode because I'm going to go a little longer than I normally would. I'm going to go until my inventory's full of um, special artifacts. I might fish the next episode entirely as well because we're on floor 33. We're not going to get many opportunities to fish after this. I might just end it because honestly the game is going to be ending soon so it's not really like I need to have it. I just want it <laughs> at this point. Because I do think I could beat the entire game without having any issues with the armor I have. It's just it's nice to have better equipment. You never know. There's always higher level stuff to grab. Twenty-seven. Well, twenty-seven, but I renown is a lot. The day star. Honestly, not a good item. Just judging by that, I can tell you it's not good. I mean, it's good if you want, like, fire resistance to armor, but... Eh, in this game, the more damage you do to kill the enemies before you get the fire resistance put in is good, but... Again, if you do have socketed equipment, and it is good equipment, I highly suggest putting that in if you have it into its maximum, which is 48 fire resistance or damage to undead. Because Mana Drain sucks. So if it adds all of those buffs at once and you are a mage, that sucks. Because every time you... You do anything, your mana will be drained. On, I'd really love to have a weapon that I can use. At this point, I think I'm gonna have to rely on the gambler. <laughs> Just getting awful luck for my own class. Other than that one helmet, that's it. That's all the fishing waters have been wanting to give me. Ah, great! I found a magic chance of magical items artifact. Great. Well... Armatory's almost full.
just gonna go with this anyway. As I said, your pet has been transformed. Your pet has been transformed. Okay. Your pet has been transformed. Oops, I accidentally used that. Alright. Gems can go over here. And gems can go in there. This can go right here. I can go there. This can go here. You and now we can go sell table. our bounty before we end the episode. Oops. Gambling is the sport of kings, you know. 77,000. I already knew that was going to be cheap. 85,000. Eh. A million! That is amazing. Also, 80,000. I kind of figured that. Hmm. With that, though, we're gonna get some quests for level 34. The quest. I'm gonna use haste before I actually end up uh, switching my gear here. There we go. Before. The quest. Yep. God, they're wasting my time. Er, thirty five. Honestly, this would be worth it just to buy it. Because my gloves don't do much. I'll just enchant it and see what I get. On this rare occasion where I enchant something. That I intend to wear. Fate has favored you. That's not good. Okay. Phew. Well... I'm just gonna have to go with that. My life already is though 341. It's it's very high. Autumn. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. I'm waiting for a zombie to leave. Uh. Hello there. Make 120,000 of that back. Just think what I can do, do for, for your reputation. reputation. That's only 147,000. I'm going to be getting that. Be upgrading my sword skill as usual. May the light shine upon you. Also, just saying, I think he's yes, yeah too 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 rich for my blood. With that, though, we are going to be getting some of these super potions and healing charms. We need only one more level 34 quest, and that is it. In the next episode of Fate, we'll be going down to level 34 and hopefully 35 of the dungeon.